Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and this is to talk about some of the upcoming uh, updates for Windows 11. A lot of you have been asking me if anything else is coming in updates because you're wondering if uh, you know more bug fixes are on the way. There are some people that are complaining of minor things happening here and there under Windows 11 install. I personally have no issues but you know it doesn't mean that it's like that for everyone. Um, if you're on release preview, the testing on release preview for Windows 11, um, there has been a push of a bug fixing update uh, last Friday, which should be available at some point, either this week or next week. But we will have, of course, a bug fixing update will be the second one for Windows 11. And we'll have probably a pretty big list of fixes once again. Now, um, this means that there will be, of course, a lot of little things that will be um, issued and addressed here in those bug fixing updates. Uh, in general, most of the people have minor bugs, little things here and there. There are things that um, it's not necessarily bugs more than they're just not implemented. Uh, for example, people are mentioning you know, a lot of the drag and drop uh, issues and stuff like that that's not working well uh, with the file explorer. Um, I've had an issue where, in my case, the file explorer is kind of interesting, is um, takes a long time to refresh the pictures. I would say that was probably and still is one of the things that I find a little weird. It kind of hangs a little bit and then it displays all the, the thumbnails, for example, or all the files in a certain folder. Um, so this is kind of, um, I'm, I'm wondering if it's not an, an issue maybe with OneDrive because I have a lot of dry, of uh, files that are actually in OneDrive but not necessarily in my computer itself. I just see a thumbnail of it. So uh, it could be connectivity with OneDrive also. But uh, overall, I haven't had really any issues or any problems of freezes, blue screens, or even performance issues. A lot of people, I'd say what is maybe the most common thing for people to mention is performance issues now we got to be careful because in there there's performance issues due to the fact that your computer might not be supported that is a different thing than performance issues for those that have a actual windows machine that is supported with all the hardware so we'll see how that happens with time but one thing for sure we're a week away or roughly a week away from uh, the um uh, the updates uh, it could happen this week I believe last month if I let's check out here the Windows update uh, history um, if we go to Windows update and check out the history of updates the update history for the bug fixing updates for last month so these are quality updates and um, we look at there was a cumulative update for the system on the 20, so the 12th was Patch Tuesday. So the 21st was uh, the uh, updates. So 21st would be sometime next week. So it possibly it's not going to be this week. It could be only next week before we receive them, uh, which would be uh, the uh, week uh, D for Windows. Um, anyways, there are always two updates a month every time for Windows 11, which is the Patch Tuesday update on the second Tuesday and the bug fixing update, which is um, either the next week or two weeks after the Patch Tuesday updates. Also, Windows 10 will uh, get some uh, bug fixing updates this month as usual. So uh, if you have issues, hang in there. Um, these updates might actually fix some of the problems. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.